Well, I'm going to be speaking uh, about the shortfalls of risk management and how we can do better. The issue really is that we all have risk. Risk affects everybody in projects and programs and in business and actually in the wider life. And a lot of the risks that we face are not managed well. So risk management is supposed to help us by giving us that forward-looking radar that scans the future, that helps us to see what's coming and helps us to deal with it proactively. And yet we're still surprised by things going wrong and our projects fail and we find we don't achieve our objectives. So something's not right with risk management. And I'd like to suggest in my presentation there are three things that we need to improve. One is that risk management manages risk and we're not always very clear about the way we think about risk. And sometimes we have a misunderstanding about what risk really is. So I want to start by making sure we're really clear on the concept of risk. What is a risk and what is not a risk? And my definition, my starting point of risk is uncertainty that matters. If it's not uncertain, it's not a risk. If it doesn't matter, we don't need to know about it. And we need to be very clear about that concept. The second thing is the process, and we've had processes for managing risk for many years, but I think there are still some blind spots in the process, some things which the process doesn't tackle very well, and I'm going to suggest a couple of places where we need to improve the risk management process. And the third thing is that risk is managed by people, not by processes or tools or techniques or machines or computers. And people, we need to take account of the people side of risk properly in order to manage risk effectively. And very often we don't. We assume that people are just like robots or machines. And of course we're not. So I'm going to be suggesting some ways in which we can take account of the people side of risk to make risk management more effective. So principles, process and people are the three areas that we need to improve. Well, who faces risk? Where, who has risk in their lives, in their projects or in their business? The answer, of course, is everybody. And so who's going to benefit from learning ways of making our risk management more effective? Everybody. So really, my presentation is not just focused at project managers or at risk specialists or at chief executives or board members. It's really for everybody. I'm applying some of these principles in my parenting or in the way that I manage my relationships or I manage my pension investments, as well as how I manage my projects and how I manage my business. So I think these principles are applicable to everybody because we all face uncertainty. Well, I come to Risk Zone because I learn. I'm here to mix with the other speakers, with the delegates, with people here who have other experiences that I've not had. And clearly it's important that we're all constantly learning, which of course is the Stanford Global uh, motto, never stop learning. And so I'm here to learn, and I think the other delegates should be as well. But the other great thing about Risk Zone is we have a really strong collection of speakers from multiple industries, from multiple countries, at different levels of, of within the business, within the organisation. And so we have a richness of insights which is not available elsewhere. So Risk Zone presents us with a unique learning opportunity in terms of insights from other people that we can apply apply to our own businesses and our own situations. That's why I come, that's why I think other people should come too.